lessons to Virginia Woolf on the backs of interpretive dance programs. I'm snapping to the rhythm of 20 point shoes, clicking on black stage lights, echoing back things too deep for me to understand on an espresso and four hours of sleep. I'm writing about moments stuck in my memory with Scott Shape and thumbtacks because blue doesn't work anymore. I've lost track of the score, it's pros versus cons, performing white collar, bled red crimes against my humanity, against my sanity, using it to scrub out stains where the rain fell on the plains and the ballerinas, in trench coats waltzing one, two, three. One, two, three. We used to skip idly through weekdays to Saturday mornings. Through healthy like children were watching their eyes wide with wonder, as love is what birds sing when wishing on Saturday mornings and arms that can pull me back down to the primary need to just lie there and breathe. Waltz to Chopin in back hallways and watch how beautiful it is when he lets her down slowly. Like a breakup that takes years, watch him lay her down on her skeleton back to the tapping of point shoes in the walls of Chopin, watch him skate away, watch her pray someone will catch her. Writing love poetry on behalf of a ballerina who's just pretending for the sake of art and the tapping of 20 point shoes on a backlit stage while I watch with my eyeliner running a half marathon to the vaults of Chopin and the sound of Virginia Woolf drowning, but I don't have any pockets and the gorge doesn't flow fast enough to carry me away. I'm no ballerina, but my poetry is letting me down slowly on my skeleton back. My poetry is the tapping of 20 point shoes on black stage lights and the curtain falls. There's no curtain calls or encores. I've lost the orchestra scores when the stage is dark. And I'm writing ballpoint promises to ballerinas who are tap, tap, tapping away. Do, 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 do.